Transportation and Communications Minister He Chen-dan promised the Taiwan Railway Labor Union that he would ask the executive yuan to approve a new salary schedule and additional hires within three days. The union, meanwhile, faults the Directorate General of Personnel Administration for sitting on its hands as the labor shortage worsens. Taiwan Railways is short 1,100 workers. The shortage means every worker has to cover the duties of two people and cannot take any days off. The Taiwan Railways Labor Union previously threatened a legal leave of absence by all workers, but relented after meeting with Minister of Transportation and Communications He Chen-dan. Minister He Chen promised to send a request to the executive yuan for additional hires within three days and to approve a salary schedule. The union criticized the executive yuan's Directorate General of Personnel Administration for never offering job openings when more workers are needed. Since it takes two years to properly cultivate a trained engineer, job openings must be created two years before engineers are needed. The DGPA says that in order to resolve the problem, changes are required in the recruiting and advancement systems. Currently, Taiwan Railways plans to hire the 1,318 personnel in stages over five years. The salary schedule has been approved by the Ministry of Transportation and Communications, but still requires approval by the executive yuan. The DGPA says that it will actively communicate with Taiwan Railways and the MOTC and that the salary schedule is in the final evaluation stage. It will soon be sent to the executive yuan for a final decision.